Jesus, honey, wax much? What? I didn't know I was gonna be wearing a bathing suit. What are you talking about? I forgot to wax. Since when, 1998? I've had other things on my mind. I could be on death row and not have that situation. Well, Samantha, when you're married, you have a different set of priorities. Oh, honey, don't blame marriage. This woman's married and she's not growing a national forest. How do you even cross your legs? Let me make you a spa appointment. Any thicker, you won't be able to find it. <clears throat> Bokertov. It's the morning time, so I get to say Bokertov. And Shalom. Um, I shaved again. It was getting a little itchy, and so um, that's what we do. Sometimes when it gets itchy, we shave. Because um, we're out of no shave November. We're in December, so we shaved. So, check this out. That's some artwork. Uh, that's not one of mine. That's uh, one of my children's uh, artwork. It's a windmill. It looks like a windmill. I just love kids' drawings. Don't you love kids' drawings? They're so honest. They're so... You know what? That's what's... What, there's many things wrong with the world. But one of the things that's wrong with the world is... Um, a lot of people don't know who they are. And then some people who know who they are don't want to be true to who they are. Because if they did that then people could hurt them and then they would be in pain and deal with sufferings and all those things that they're trying to prevent so they act like there's someone else they put on a you know a mask and they 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 do their thing and that way they're able to deflect and um refract i don't know i mean there's propagating things happening, there are tachyons, there are um, things happening in the stratosphere, and supernovas happening way out in space. Um, all time, space, and matter was made by our creator, and exponentially there are things happening that we can try to measure. You know, um, there's chaos math, there's quantum theory, there's cold fusion, Science is very interesting, but uh, let's take it back to, um, you know, walking in the truth, being honest, you know, being sincere and genuine and, and asking God for help and then receiving the help and asking God, hey, so when you're going to give me the help I'm asking for, no matter what form of help it is, help me to just be humble and hard as a little child and just thankful and joyful and help me to receive whatever help it is that you're giving me. So I can receive that, so I can be put in order and, and be whole, and then that way when I'm going out and about and I'm you know interacting with people and connecting with people and functioning in society, that you can work through me to bring a solution and to bring comfort and to bring counsel to other people. And the more and more this kind of stuff plays out, the better things are going to be for everyone. Um, in the time after the New World Order, when the little guy, you know, takes his little and tries to be God, after that's done away with and the Lord is in Jerusalem ruling over all the earth, everything will be set in order, and that's good. So, with that, I was going to say, uh, read Psalm 14. I'm going to say that one more time. Read Psalm 14, and... Um, I apologize for the clip for the little scene from uh, Sex in the City. I thought it was funny. I try to keep things light and funny. And I know that, you know, some people could be like, oh, that was inappropriate. Well, you know what? There's a lot of things in this world that are inappropriate. But it's important for us to remember that our king, when he came down, he was having dinner with a bunch of people that aren't, weren't really all that appropriate. And um, he is known as the friend of sinners. And, you know, if we think that we're these lofty saints that are above sin and we don't sin, then we're deceiving ourselves. <laughs> so it's important to remember that we are um, supposed to be friends of sinners because we are sinners ourselves. And we are to do our best to remain pure and chaste and humble and clean 
and kosher, you know, spiritually and, and all that. That's important, yes. But, um, you know, when we're around things, to not be easily offended, you know, to be kind, to be patient. This, this is the way, the way of love. All right. Psalm 14, read it. Shalom and Godspeed.